Hey everybody, this is Sandra, and today I am making apple pie spice. Okay, I just ran to the grocery store because I was out of um, nutmeg. Okay, it's the middle of October. Why are they running out of spices? Um, did I miss something? Anyway, I'm just saying, if you guys know that you're going to be cooking for the upcoming holidays, get your stuff together. Okay, which is why we're doing these videos now to give you guys some ideas. So for my pumpkin spice, because I'm multiplying the recipe. But anyway, let me show you the recipe. Very simple. Apple pie spice. One half teaspoon of ground cinnamon, three fourth teaspoon of ground nutmeg, one fourth teaspoon of ground allspice, and one fourth teaspoon of ground cardamom. Now, I had never heard of cardamom before. Well, I don't guess I had. But anyway, I had to order, order this from the internet. I got it from Amazon, just in case you guys are interested, okay? Because um, my local stores didn't have it. So, anyway, maybe just my area, I don't know. But, like I said, this is for, well, I'm not sure how much of a serving, because each recipe is going to tell you how much to use. But... If you want to multiply yours like I multiply mine, see right there. But because I'm putting mine in those jars, but when the recipe is all in the same unit, like this, this is all in teaspoons. Keep in mind that you can easily multiply that one. So let's say if you want to convert the teaspoon to cups, be one and a half cup of ground cinnamon. Three four cup of nutmeg, one four cup of allspice, and one four cup of cardamom. Okay, so when it's like I said, when this um, the same unit, you can easily convert it to larger units. Easy peasy, right? Okay. So anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and mix my spices up together, and when I come back, I'm gonna let you see what it looks like. Y'all, it's so easy. It's ridiculous. Don't be don't get caught off guard without having your spices when you need them. That's all I got to say. Give me a minute. Be back. Okay, here's my um, apple pie spice. And I ended up with two jars of it. Also, let me say, when you mix your spices, okay, do what you want to. But I prefer to use something like this, like a clear glass bowl. Because um, I like to look around the sides to make sure that I got everything mixed up well and I usually mix everything up with a fork I would say a fork or maybe even a um a whisk to mix your, mix your spices up well but anyway so I got plenty of apple pie spice these jars by the way there are they are um seven ounce jars that's what they were yeah seven ounce jars but anyway, uh, so mix your spices and you have plenty for the upcoming holidays. See y'all next time. 